Hi everyone, hope you're having a good Labor Day weekend. I'm actually at a different place today. I am at my sister's house because she and her family went out of town for the weekend and I'm dog sitting her golden doodle. His name is Messy. If you'd like to see what he looks like, he's got an Instagram. It's called messy.dude and that's messy as in M as in Mary, E-S-S-I dot D-O-O-D. So check out his uh, Instagram. So I got a haul, well, actually not a haul, I'm sorry. I got a happy mailbox from my good friend, Karamia's Corner here on YouTube. Now me and um, Clarissa have been friends for years. We are real life friends. So we you know, typically send each other a box full of stuff uh, once or maybe even twice a year. So I believe this is probably the second box for the year. So um, let me, let's just go ahead and um, take everything out. So starting with, most of the stuff is from Daiso. She got me this doily mat, which is made out of like a vinyl. Um, it's got like a non-slip underneath. And I thought this would be really great for like as a backdrop, you know, for um, pictures, for Instagram, videos, you know, things like that. So I asked her to get me one because I'd seen somebody else haul this. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off. I'll take the staples off later on. Ooh, I don't want this to actually, you know what? I'm going to leave that on. I don't want to ruin it because I'm going to have to get a staple remover. So I'm just going to pull stuff out randomly from the box. Okay. She looks like she sent me this cute little pencil case. It says animal life story on it. It's, um, it's really small, which I like. Let's take that out. And, uh, yeah, this would go really well inside my backpack bag okay so we'll put that oh I love this it's a washi set um, they look like they're stamps they're travel stamps of some kind let's see yeah these are awesome it's not perforated so you'd have to um, cut it yourself but I love these I'm always, you know, on the hunt for, like, travel-related stuff, um, crafty, you name it. I asked her to get me this. This is a, um, on uh, sorry, on Geary, uh, maker, and this one in particular is made out of silicon, so makes it a little bit easier to make your own on Geary, um, on a Geary, excuse me. So I'm eager to try this out. Okay, let's see here. Oh, she sent me this little cute stationery set with stickers. Oh, how cute. I love anime and manga. I've, I used to collect stuff like this too. Actually, I don't think this is a stationery, stationery set. This is more like, um, like a paper doll type of set, but still. I like it. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Ooh, this is a uh, spring-themed memo pad. Nice, I always like that kind of stuff. Um, here's a cute little notebook. Oh yeah, she told me she had sent these. They're like little adhesive pockets that you can put like in a traveler's, traveler's notebook or the insert. Sorry, I'm like having a hard time speaking today. Um, but yeah, this is really cute. I guess you could tear away these sheets. So, Ricolama. Okay. Huh. These are compressed towels. I have never used these before, so I'm going to have to look it up. But I was curious. And this would probably be really good for travel. <laughs> she uh, she had bought me a pack of these um, adhesive squares before I had been able to get my hands on them at Target. So um, I can always use more of these because, you know, sometimes they're just hard to get a hold of because people, when they see them like me, you'll buy like five or ten of them, you know. So always good to have. Uh, let's see here. Ooh, this is interesting. Um, it is a notebook. Look like the notebook cover with a zip. Yeah, 
So you can put stuff in. I like that. And then looks like she added a notebook in there, but let me pull it out so you can see what it really looks like. So you've got this pocket, this pocket, and then two card pockets and a pen loop. Um, this is really nice. And then she added, it looks like a um, Target dollar spot notebook in there. I'm guessing that this is a B6 size because it's like five, it's like five by seven. Okay, so let's see. She's got two little boxes here. She had featured this in one of her hauls, I think from Savers. So let's see what's inside. Oh yeah, she had included some stuff that she got from, there you go, BB Crafts. So she had done a tutorial on how to, I think she's done a tutorial on this, on how to make the pendants. She might have, or she might've just showed the, the finished products, but she also got some beads, which are metallic beads, which are good, because um, I can definitely use those but I like the little boxes. I think these are like Chinese ring boxes of some sort. And then let's see what's in here. Oh, earrings to make your own earrings. So yeah, the earring, bezel and the dome. So I might make some earrings for myself. I don't know, I'll have to figure out what I'm gonna use. Okay. Ooh, this is, um, I think this came from maybe like a your creative studio haul that she um, had featured one time and these are like tickets although I guess yeah see they're perforated so right there you can see what kind of tickets they are good for junk journals you know or layouts for um, your travel travelers notebook see I can't talk today okay so these are origami paper packs. Um, I'd asked her to get me some because one of my nieces has expressed an interest in origami. Plus these are always good to use as, um, backdrops for anything like travel, you know, your TN and stuff. So we got this one. We got a tropical looking one, more of like a, definitely a Japanese themed one, which has a hundred sheets. And then this one right here, character design, as they would say in Japan. Um, I might give this one to my niece, but definitely useful and you can't beat a dollar fifty. Oh yeah, here we go. This is the different designs. Oh, cute. I like the little shirts, so I'll definitely have my niece um, try to make one and then I'll post a picture of it. So let's see what's in here. Aha, here's some more of the stuff that she got from BB Crafts. So you can put them on the outside of like a junk journal. These are pretty. I like the butterfly and I like this. Yeah. something in the background it's probably my sister's dog chewing on his rubber ball that he's obsessed with so um, this is also from Daiso uh, it's a set of pens and uh, 0.7 and she said that these are really good pens and if they are I might have to get more Clarissa <laughs> I don't have a Daiso here in Tennessee so but I do have four Tuesday mornings I can go to <laughs> she got me more double-sided tape because why not we can always use double-sided tape um, here's another one. This one is, what size is this? Oh, there we go, 15 millimeters, and then this is 10. So, there we go. Um, some stickers, I love these stickers. And then more stickers. A cute patch, I might put that on my backpack, my travel backpack. Um, and then some page flags and I use these page flags and the funny thing is I actually use them for like when I'm reading a book as my bookmark um, and this one too I use like the actual like um, 
what do you call it, post-it note ones, because I have tons of them. Um, yeah, because I always like tend to put those bookmarks down and then I forget where I put them, versus this, I put it on the cover when I'm reading the book and then I can put it back on when um, I'm, you know, I'm done reading. Let's see, a business card holder. Hmm. I wonder what I can insert in here so I can business cards. Oh, well, yeah. I guess you could stick like ephemera in there, but it's still nice. I love the color. Yeah. That's the thing about um, Daiso. They have such great quality products versus like Dollar Tree. Um, even though Daiso has their stuff made in China, their quality control or they demand more from the, uh, how do I say this? Um, they just have stricter quality control, you know, and they're still able to keep the price down, which is something I wish Dollar Tree would do. Okay, so looks like she got me a big set of these notebooks. Yeah, it's a sticker. So these have a vinyl cover on them, which is great. Lots of pages, very smooth. So they come in different designs. Looks like it's two of each. So yeah, I got a set of six here. Really, really pretty and useful, you know? Um, the hilarious part is this right here. She also got this, I think, from Savers. Um, and you, you can use these in your junk journal. She didn't get it so that I could write down voicemail notes. <laughs> but um, it's just funny because I remember having to use this, you know, when I would get a voicemail or have to, you know, for my boss or whatnot. So, yeah. Still good to use, like I said, for the junk journals. Okay, she also got these from Savers. Fasten double-sided tape. Curious. Oh, so it comes with a, huh, that's actually pretty wide. I'm wondering if this is really strong. I hope it is. It's kind of good that it has its own dispenser, you know? So we'll see. I'll let you guys know if it's any good. And, okay, I'm gonna save the other thing that she made for me as a lot, the last thing I show. Here's a, a little pad that she got, probably on clearance, or probably in a um, Michael's, um, what do you call those, those mystery boxes, you know, you get for like $5 or whatnot. She might've got it from that. This one I asked for. It's a handheld fan, but it is um, chargeable, okay, USB. And um, because here in Tennessee, and I'm in Memphis in particular, it gets humid as Ugh, just too humid, okay? Like it could be 91 degrees outside and the heat index is like, what, 103, okay? So it looks like it comes with a stand, so you can set it up like that, or like that so you can see. So like I said, it's chargeable, has its own little wrist strap. I guess you put it here, and let's see. Ooh, that's at the highest level and that's strong. This is perfect. Like if I'm, I'm like, if I'm waiting in the car or something, you know, and I uh, have the engine off. Oh, this is, this is really good. I love this for $5. That's amazing, Clarissa. Oh, look at that. And it has a light. That is so good. Yeah. 500 yen, probably $5. I get, I'm assuming. Okay. It might've been a little bit more. I'm not sure. I'll have to ask her, but yeah, if I had seen these in Japan when I went to the one Daiso that I was able to go to, I would have bought like three of these to give away. All right, so the last thing I've got here is a um, insert that she made for me. Okay, read me, but I'm not going to read it out loud. Okay, so let's see. Ooh. So she, she's used the adhesive pockets and she's given me some of her goodies from uh, your creative studio. Some vellum flowers. Looks like these are, what is this? Oh, okay, some like 
small sheets. They're like tags, but they're very, very thin. So I definitely have to glue that down. You could even decoupage, I guess, with it. Put that in. Let's see. Yeah, she did. She gave me some of the, this was like tickets, but I like how she did this, the little pocket. And then here's another pocket with more tickets. So I don't want to really pull everything out. Looks like it's starting to fall out. Let's see, some stickers, beautiful. Oh, I see what that's attached to. She sewed this together. How nice. You did a good job, Clarissa. Okay. And then, don't know if there is a pocket here. I can, oh, that's just tape. And then here's more stuff. It's falling out, but it's still, ooh, vellum. There's some um, butterflies. Okay, let me stick this back in. Overall, this is amazing, Clarissa. You should be selling these, okay? I know, well, I mean, you bought the stuff that's, that goes in it, but just this in general is a great idea because um, you can just slip it into your TN, TN. Speaking of which, I didn't bring one with me since, like I said, I'm not home. Um, there it is. So that concludes the haul from Karamia's Corner, the Happy Mailbox. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and um, I will be back with more hauls. I have a massive Tuesday morning haul that I've, I'm going to post, um, and then maybe some other things. Okay, so everybody have a great Sunday, and be safe, wash your hands, and wear a mask. Thank you.